Uh, I'm here. My name is Bratton Riley. I'm the CEO of CityBot. I'm here in Charleston, South Carolina. And I got home late. I, my head hit the pillow at two o'clock this morning. I was in a conference in Texas the first half of the week. And a little back in black at three o'clock in the afternoon is just what I needed. Um, so thank you all for being here. So CityBot is a customer service chat solution through text and web and Facebook and Twitter, soon to be WhatsApp, soon to be voice for government customer service. We use AI to power conversations between residents and their governments to answer questions, to facilitate service requests coming in, and at any point in time, enable the resident to communicate what they need to communicate through a message and they get an immediate response. You've all had chat experiences thus far. We are all consumers. Your residents are consumers and their expectations are going up on the level of customer service that they can receive. Our sweet spot is really helping governments implement new technology so they can serve and meet those expectations but also do more with less. Every government is trying to figure out how do we do more with less? And we're here to help you do that through AI. There was an article that just came out in Science Times to say, well, why are governments turning to chatbots? You know, lightning speed support, multiple queries at the same time, omni-channel experience, great data, which we collect for you, build those relationships of trust, and down here, reduce cost, saving governments over 9%, of their money. So what does CityBot do? It answers questions. You can enable service requests. So you can send in personalized messages. We're powered by a lot of the Amazon technology. We're built to scale. Uh, and we New Orleans is a customer of ours. Uh, God bless the residents of that city and that state. Uh, on Monday, the only system that was working was our chat system. 311 went down, 911 went down. CityBot, they call it Jazz. We launched it as Jazz. We brand it to our government customers. It's a very fun part of the process. Jazz, for a while, was the only thing that was working on Monday to help the residents get their needs met. Uh, and it was such an honor for us to help our customer when they need it the most through such unfortunate circumstances. So I'm going to show you text. Here's Fort Worth, Texas. A resident texts hello to the system, a greeting comes back. That's your greeting. You say what that greeting wants to, and here they're reporting a pothole. So we built that conversation in AI, so a resident can report a pothole, my trash wasn't picked up, how do I get a license, uh, et cetera. And then when they confirm that's what they wanna do, we're gonna drop that into your backend tech ecosystem, regardless of what tech you are powered on. It's a very important part of what we do is connect our API to yours so that that data that comes through chat can come into the systems that you're already using. So this is Motorola for Fort Worth, pothole service request comes in, all the data, conversation history, and we bring in a live chat as well. So we do that through these multiple channels. I'll take you over to web momentarily so you can see some other customers of ours. Here's New Orleans. We just changed this message today. So when you click on Jazz in New Orleans from the website, we're telling residents that need an oxygen tank and they don't have power, where are the stations that they can get an oxygen tank so that they can stay alive? Um, and then let's go to some other places. Arlington, Texas, this is what their chat interface looks like. Let's go over here to Aurora, Colorado. Here's their interface. You click on it. You can ask your question. How do I get a parking? And you can see, of course, I can't spell when I have to do this for an audience. And I can't spell when I'm not doing it for an audience. Uh, but you ask the question and we bring back the answer. And you can always check the message button if you want to to send in your personal communication. Here's the message button down here. So it's questions, it's answers, it's personalized messages, it's multi-channel, feeds back into your ecosystem. We're gonna save you time and money and we're gonna run data on the communications. Here's data from New Orleans this week. One 
a lot of these questions are about evacuation plans, et cetera. So we help bring this data to help support you every day. Thank you so much, CityBot Chat Solutions, for your customer service. I'm Bratton Riley. Thank you so much.